Maureen O'Hara always more than held her own in movies with her leading men, be it Cornell Wilde, Jerome Power, Errol Flynn, and of course John Wayne. And because of it, authors James Robert Parrish and Donnie Stanky dedicated their book, The Swashbucklers, to Maureen O'Hara, calling her the loveliest swashbuckler of them all. Amen to that. Before I met Maureen O'Hara for the first time, I'd, I'd been thinking, it's, wow, she's starred in so many films that are now considered classics. And I was thinking primarily of The Quiet Man, How Green Is My Valley, Hunchback of Notre Dame, of course, The Parent Trap, certainly Miracle on 34th Street, those five films primarily. And I said to her, you know, it must be wonderful to know that you've made five truly classic movies. Well, up to that point, she'd been smiling and charming, but suddenly she kind of drew herself up and she said, I've made 14 classic films. And that was that. Wow. I mean, I always thought it was the perfect way to be introduced to Maureen O'Hara. No nonsense. Well, I was just happy she didn't slug me the way she slugged John Wayne and The Quiet Man. After she corrected me and made her point, she couldn't have been nicer. Coming up next, Maureen, again in Technicolor, this time the virtuous heroine with the Randy Sinbad the Sailor chasing her with a twinkle in his eye as our salute to Maureen O'Hara continues. the fun 